Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Null32 Nico Esme channel. And today we're tackling a common question that often leads to some confusion. Are you really shutting down your Windows laptop? Many of you might think you are, but thanks to a feature called Fast Startup, your computer might just be taking a quick nap instead of a full power down. And why does this matter? Well, a true shutdown is crucial for installing updates properly, resolving certain software glitches, and even extending the life of your battery by allowing it to completely rest. So if you've ever felt like your laptop isn't quite fresh after a shutdown, or you're having trouble with updates, this video is for you. First, let's quickly understand what Fast Startup is and why Microsoft decided to include it. Fast Startup is a feature in Windows that's designed to make your computer boot up faster after a shutdown. Think of it as a hybrid sleep mode. When you shut down your PC with Fast Startup enabled, Windows doesn't completely turn off. Instead, it saves an image of the kernel and loaded drivers to a hibernation file. Then when you power on, it simply reloads that image, bypassing the full boot process. Now let's talk about the pros and cons of this feature. On the plus side, the main benefit is right there in the name, faster boot times. Your laptop will appear to start up much quicker, getting you back to work or play in less time. However, there are significant downsides. Because it's not a true shutdown, fast startup can uh, prevent proper installation of updates. Updates often require a full power cycle to complete, cause driver issues or hardware glitches. Your hardware might not fully reset, leading to strange behavior, interfere with dual boot systems. If you run Linux alongside Windows, fast startup can make Windows lock the drive preventing Linux from accessing it properly, drain battery life in some cases. While in this hybrid state, some components might still draw a minimal amount of power. So, for a truly fresh start and to avoid these potential issues, performing a full shutdown is often preferred. Before we dive into permanently disabling fast startup, let me show you a quick restart trick that forces a full shutdown without disabling fast startup. This is handy if you need a quick, full refresh, but want to keep fast startup for daily use. To do this, simply go to your start menu, click on the power icon, and then select restart. Yes, just choosing restart actually performs a full shutdown and reinitialization of your system. It's a great troubleshooting step. All right, now let's get into how to permanently disable Fast Startup for those who prefer a full shutdown every time they hit the power button. The first step is to open your start menu. You can do this by clicking on the Windows icon in the bottom of your screen or by simply pressing the Windows key on your keyboard. Once the start menu is open, type Control Panel into the search bar. You'll see Control Panel appear in the search results. Click on it to open the Control Panel window. Now inside the control panel, make sure your view by option is set to small or large icons. This usually makes things easier to find. Then click on power options. On the left hand side of the power options window, you'll see a few links. Click on choose what the power buttons does. This next step is important you'll notice that some of the shutdown settings are greyed out. To make changes, you need to click on Change Settings that are currently unavailable. This usually requires administrator privileges, so you might get a UAC User Account Control prompt. Just click Yes if you do. Now scroll down a bit and you'll see a section called Shutdown Settings. The culprit we're looking for is Turn on Fast Startup Recommended you'll see a checkbox next to it. Simply uncheck that box. Once you've unchecked, turn on Fast Startup. Don't forget the final and crucial step. Click on the Save Changes button at the bottom of the window. If you don't click Save Changes, your modifications won't be applied. And that's it. You've successfully disabled Fast Startup. From now on, whenever you choose to shut down your laptop from the Start menu, your computer will perform a full, complete power off. You might notice your laptop takes a few seconds longer to boot up, but for many, 
That's a small trade-off for a truly refreshed system, proper updates, and avoiding potential issues. So, give this a try and let me know in the comments if you notice a difference in your laptop's performance or if it helps resolve any issues you were having. Remember, you can always re-enable fast startup if you prefer faster boot times and don't experience the downsides. If this video helped you out, please give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and subscribe for more tech tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.